Hello again, unicorn daddy, composer, sound addict, passionate human being, Alex. <laughs> Simply me. Um, and today I shall be talking about AI art, mid journey and the like, you know, technology that um, allows you, enables you to become a great artist. No, not really. But before I dive in, uh, did you know that I'm writing a soundtrack for the Seal Marillion, taking you on a journey to the first age of Arda, to um, witness the Oath of Feanor, to witness Beren encountering Luthien in the forest of Neldoreth, maybe a bit more magical than this one. Anyway, I'm going to show you all the grandeur and the glory in the soundtrack. The link is below, the band camp, to band camp. And let's get started talking about AI art. First of all, I'm going to start saying... If you've been following my journey, um, I had art for, you know, for my, for the cover of my singles, albums, I collaborated with artists and for various reasons. Um, some of these collaborations, you know, didn't work out too well. Um, and then I kind of, um, I stumbled on Mid Journey. Um, and, um, you know, quite honestly, quite honestly, I was talking about ego a lot in the past videos. Um, this is an ego thing, you know. In a way, I wanted to control each and every aspect of my artistic image, right? So there's the music, and then I wanted, I had a vision of a cover of art that I wa wanted to use, um, and I felt those artists that I was collaborating with didn't quite um, meet that vision. Right. Hello. Um, and these. It's a, it's a, sorry. <laughs> um, and the, so they they weren't quite representing my vision of events, of characters, of places. Right. So my ego kind of convinced me. Yeah, you know, with this, you can actually be the artist. Right. I could, I mean, I have artistic vision, I can visualize this. I just don't have the skills, of course, because I didn't do the decades of um, hard work becoming good at drawing, right? So I, I can draw nice unicorns for my daughter. <laughs> and she always says they're so beautiful. Uh, but that doesn't make me an artist, of course, right? Um, so you've seen me then go on to create uh, cover art and then I made videos with these AI images. I never really just generated them. Of course I used Photoshop and uh, drew around them and there was... Maybe I'll make a video about the process. But anyway, just, just honest, right? Just honestly, let's <laughs> strip naked here, <laughs> figuratively speaking. Um, yeah. I just wanted control over each and every aspect. I wanted this to be my images, just like initially when I was writing the Silmarillion music. It was, it was all about me and, uh, you know, my ego. And I recently decided that actually, you know, why am I doing this? You know, I love music. I love art. Uh, it makes me happy. And it makes me mostly happy because there is a human interaction, right? I feel connected to those people um, who, you know, create who, to other creators or to those that I share my works with. Which, actually, you know, I kind of um, have also changed my workflow that to the point where I'm... It's not all me forcing out stuff from within myself, but actually tapping into the universe, so to speak, or, you know, the creative force. It's not all about me, right? So I, I really think that being a true artist and honoring authenticity, I cannot do things that go against my core values. 
like this, like using AI art services, which would then replace real people and the genuine, heartfelt, human interaction that we could have. So I said, scrap it. I'm going to quit. So I cancelled the subscription. And uh, what I'll do in, in, instead is, of course, genuine networking. Finding people to share this vision with. Uh, people who I admire, whose art makes me feel something, right? Who, whose art takes me on a journey, right? And then what can happen? So, um, I've contacted an absolutely wonderful artist, um, and uh, yeah, I'll keep you updated about that. But I just wanted to say, yeah, goodbye mid-journey and goodbye AI stuff. And I want to focus this channel on, on the very human process of interacting through art, media, uh, music and stories. Right, that's it for today. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs>